Hello everyone, my name is Jun Dongli. I'm currently a PhD student from Arizona State University. In this video, I will give a brief introduction about our KDD paper, Unsupervised Feature Selection in Sand Social Networks. Feature selection is effective to prepare high-dimensional data for many learning tasks by selecting a subset of features of high quality. Nowadays, massive amounts of high-dimensional data such as texts, images, and videos are user-generated and quickly disseminated in social media. Social media data has its distinct properties as it is not independent and identically distributed but is inherently connected. Also, social media data is often unlabeled. Without label information, it is difficult to access feature relevance. Some of the existing efforts on feature selection for network data overwhelmingly focus on positive user interactions such as friendships and user-following relations. They make use of the positive links to guide feature selection in the content space. In addition to these positive links, negative links are also prevalent in many social networking platforms, such as the distrust relations in opinions and false in slash dot. Recent studies show that negative links have added values over positive links in advancing many real-world applications such as sentiment analysis and recommendation. Therefore, it motivates us to think if negative links could also be helpful in finding relevant features. In this work, we studied the problem of feature selection in signed social networks and proposed a lower framework called SignedFS. It has three steps. In the first step, we make use of the both positive and negative user interactions to learn user latent repetitions. As user latent repetitions encode some hidden attributes of users, they should be closely related to some features. Therefore, in the second phase, we take it as constraint to guide feature selection in the content space. In the third phase, we revisit the principle of homophily and the balance theory in signed social networks and model the user proximity by a signed graph regularization. More details and findings can be found in our paper. You are welcome to read it. That's all for the introduction. Thank you very much.